What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're going to be playing Ghost of Tsushima again. And this is part 7 of me playing it. So I'm sorry I did not record yesterday. It's just that yesterday I was sick and I missed out school. And since I was sick and I missed out school, I couldn't record. I don't get how that's a fair rule, but still. Anyways, today we're going to be continuing the search for Tomoe. So now, so now let's go. Which one? So we're going to be continuing the search for Tomoe. So we got to go to Sensei Ishikawa. And when we're done, and when we might finish all of it, then we will like, you know, continue like the actual mission. Okay, I think I already got enough flowers so I could buy myself a new sword. Oh, I didn't realize this place was blocked. So for the whole time while I was sick, I was just playing a game called Teardown. It's actually a really fun game. All you gotta do is just destroy some stuff and it describes me perfectly. I like to destroy stuff. Actually, never mind. It doesn't describe me. It describes this other YouTuber called PlainRock124. So since I did not record yesterday, I'll make it up to you guys, and I'm going to make this video a little longer. Usually it's one hour, but now I'm going to make this video probably, hopefully, maybe two hours, alright? If I can't make it two hours, then I'll just probably record for like maybe an hour and 50 or an hour and 30. One of Tomoe's training camps is around here. Pushy. This is Tomoe's training camp. Ah, the ghost! Don't kill me! What's going on? Take whatever you want. Why? I'm not a thief. Uh, everyone knows you're attacking caravans. The ghost and the demon Sensei. Sensei Ishikawa? That's a lie. I've heard you myself. Heard us? When? Not long ago, tearing up the road like starving wolves. What? How are Sensei Ishikawa and I being blamed for highway robbery? <sighs> and North, find out who's responsible. So about the Drake and Kendrick beef. It's pretty stupid. They're just only doing this just for like, you know, cash. 
And to be fair, what Kendrick said about Drake is true. Drake is a pedophile. But I mean, I still like his music, but still, Drake, he is a pedophile. Like, let me explain to you this. So you guys, so I take it you guys know who Millie Bobby Brown is. Like, she is the girl who played Eleven in Stranger Things. And to be fair, she's honestly a really good actor. Yeah, I before, back in 2017, did not know her because I didn't watch Stranger Things that time. Because, see, back in 2017, I was kind of a kid. Ah, uh, damn it. You're welcome, Sensei. You're the ghost. What happened here? His caravan was ambushed. Lots of attacks lately. People say you're stealing supplies. Or sided with the Mongols. Rest easy. I'll discuss this with Lord Sakai. Tomoe is behind this. She sows paranoia and fear. Attacking caravans, blaming us. I caught up to his group too late. Saved him, but not the others. Where was he ambushed? Close. Why? Find the ambush site. Track the rest of Tomoe's group to their camp. That makes sense. What's wrong? Nothing. She has me off balance. We'll put an end to that. Rest here. Eat the food I gave you. And wait a while before you leave. Thank you, Sensei. Show me where he was ambushed. <laughs> Don't worry. How did you find me? Someone heard a convoy being chased. People avoid the roads because of Tomoe. When I caught wind of a merchant chancing a supply run, I followed. We're here to find and destroy Tomoe's training camp, but the safety of the island is our priority. I don't see how those conflict. I was trying to save that convoy. You could have easily caught up to them. You used them as bait. So what if I did? That's a dangerous path to travel, Sensei. Tomoe betrayed everything I taught her. Then she betrayed me. And after me, her home. I'll hunt her past the horizon if I must. There's the convoy. And more victims of Tomoe. Let's see what we can learn. When are we gonna finally Tomoe see this Tomoe? Of you know what, forget, Tomoe we're gonna see her today. From Lord Sakai and Sensei Ishikawa. No travel is permitted on these roads. On pain of death. Crude, but effective. They took off down the road. And we'll find them. survivors Japanese and Mongo arrows of course this is the last time Tomoe and her men will ambush anyone in Kushi prefecture come anyway it's about anyway it's about that and anyway, it's about like Dra Drake and Millie so she so he basically been talking to Millie ever since she was 13 or 11 he was basically talking to Millie ever since he was she was 13 or 11 and to be fair that is kind of weird but not weird for me because see because see I've known I don't know if that's weird or not because see I'd known Faison for like years and I've known him ever since he was probably like you know 20 or something I'll cut her loose but so he's my friend we go same gym together okay What did she say? She said I could live until the samurai came. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. No, Shoot.
You don't forget I'm going up there. I think I'm gonna let you live that easy. right into it I spoke with her two days ago Tomoe the captive heard her talking about a Japanese woman she saw with the Mongols I asked her to find out where they were camped and report back you did what huh it could have gone the other way we'd be standing over Tomoe's body instead you talk about what it means to be a warrior <sighs> how Tomoe undermines that but you and she are the same. You expect us to be perfect. Your uncle, me, Masako Adachi. <laughs> but only a child expects perfection of his elders. Finish your thought, Sensei. We all carry weapons. We okay. all choose between life and death. And okay. you're too comfortable with that power. And if I weren't, I would be dead. And so would you. Ghost. Not everyone can be a samurai. But we're all killers. We still have a camp in Otsuna to deal with. Okay, now. So maybe next time, maybe in, in Act Three, I will do the mission. I'll do. I'll continue the mission for the Hunt of Tomoe. I could just take these horses if I wanted. Mm, nah, nah. I already chose my horse and I'm gonna be loyal to. <clears throat> Do you need a new quiver or satchel? No, no, I need the iron. Oh, wait, 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 what? Oh, I'm gonna buy iron. No, 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 no. Goodbye. No, because, see, if I buy iron with my supply bags, then I'll just end up losing my supply, and I need to... <coughs> No, I need the supply for it. If you can bring more, it's yours. For sharpening the sword. Stay here. Still, even if you dazzle with Kami's protection. This also looks nice. Anyways, Drake Drake texted Millie while she when she was 11, and that's honestly weird. But it's not weird for me because, see, I texted Faison. I mean, I was, I've known Faison ever since, like, 
I was 13, yeah. But see that, but see, he wasn't like, you know, old that time. Like Drake, I don't know how old he was when he texted Millie. <clears throat> I don't know how old he was when he texted Millie, but so to me it's not weird because see Faison, because see Faison, he probably knew my brother, so technically it's fine. And I don't know if my brother and Faison are still friends, but still. But still, Faison and I are still friends. <laughs> I mean, he's honestly a really nice guy. He's honestly a really nice guy, and he agreed with me. And he agreed with me when, when I told him about Spider-Man supporting the LGBTQ. It's honestly pretty stupid. Like, I've been waiting to watch a new Spider-Man movie ever since No Way Home. And this is what I get, an LGBT movie. But it's a good thing, it's a good thing that... That I've traveled to Thailand to watch it. But not mostly just to watch it. I mostly go to Thailand just for my grandma. And... And I only decided to watch it there since the day, since Thailand supports the LGBT. And I did watch, I did watch Spider-Man Across the Vir Spider-Verse, and it's honestly a really good movie. And I don't care if it has an LGBT rating. They only added one part in the movie. They could have easily cut that out. Anyways. <coughs> Is all this Tomoe's work? She and her mongos have been busy. A woman here named Lan knows where to find her. Lead the way. It, it was it was easy. They could have like you know edit that out, like you know make it Dubai friendly. And I have a feeling that that's gonna be ha that's gonna also happen to Beyond the Spider Verse, but that won't be a problem for me since since I'm gonna soon graduate and since I'm graduating, I will go to I could travel to Thailand and you know watch it. Or if I want, I could travel to America to watch it, but I don't really want to go to America since it's the most LGBT country in the world now. Yes, my lords. The Mongols who did this to you, they were led by one of our own. Tomoe, I'll never forget that face. What did she look like? With a group of thieves who lived here. That's not possible. Tomoe is from Umugi Prefecture. She found her way here. Her ball terrorized Utsna for years. People used to say she could knock a falcon from the sky, blindfolded. This camp you found, where is it? The forest southwest of here. The oh, between the river and the western shore. Hold on a second. <sighs> Anyways, I'll be graduating soon, so I'll have, so I'll be able to have enough time to like you know buy a plane ticket to get like a plane ticket to go to any country I want to watch it. If I want to go Switzerland, I'll go Switzerland. If I want to go Bangkok, I'll go Bangkok. If I want to go to America, I'll go to America. Before we fought. I offered to adopt Tomoe as my daughter, make her samurai. For someone like her, that's quite a change in fortune. And I took it away. Because she's a hired killer. Because her sensei failed her. She fell back into the life she knew. It's one thing to wreck your chance at a better life, but to terrorize your own people. I am aware, Sakai. Are you? Can I count on you to do what needs to be done? We have a camp to find. He was gonna adopt Tomoe. We need to stop Tomoe before she takes more lives. Okay, maybe, maybe today we'll finally see Tomoe. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe in Act Three we'll see. 
will be able to fight her. Because now, hearing about this Tomoe girl, I want to fight her. Because now, hearing about Tomoe, I want to fight her badly. After everything she's done, she deserves punishment. Yes, she does. If she were willing to fight for us, would you trust her? No. The woman we spoke to said Tomoe terrorized people here. It must have been years ago. Tomoe would have been young. In her teens. And holding her own among bandits. Hmm. Difficult for someone twice her age. And you never suspected anything. When she began her study with me, she hid a small blade in her sleeve. And she secretly hoarded food. I can see how you could overlook those signs. <sighs> there were others. I wanted to make her my heir so badly. I blinded myself to the truth. The camp should be nearby. Perfect terrain for archers lying in wait. Keep your eyes open. Dismount keep, here. I'm keeping my eye open. Stay low and find a good place to scout the camp. Up here. We've seen this before. What do you see? Japanese arrows. Of course. Bodies used for archery practice. Tomoe's signature. Shut this camp down. Keep your eyes open for Tomoe. Ready when you are, Sensei. I'll stay heated until you strike. There comes some part of luck. Well, it's obvious she was here. <clears throat> okay, we need to search around. Maybe I need to check out this area. Sensei, over here. Oh. Sensei? What the hell do I check? Search the side of Tomoe's camp, okay. <laughs> Imagine if there was Ghost of Tsushima VR. That would honestly be pretty cool. I mean, I would play it, but I can't. But I won't make a series of it because 
usually my series are like two or two or one out one or two hours and i don't want to keep my face on a headset for that long i couldn't find anything sensei Okay, now that's high. This is still part of the campsite. Hold on a second. Okay, okay, I think I figured it out now. Could be Tomoe. The sensei and the oh, ghost. Tomoe! I'm tired of you two. Your archers are dead. It's over. Ambush. Go after Tomoe. Okay. Okay. Chase scene. Oh, there you are. <clears throat> Tomoe, this only ends one way. Ha, keep telling yourself that. Why do you hate him so much? There's nowhere to go, Tomoe. You need to work harder, Lord Sakai. Dead end, Tomoy. Tomoy. So you're old Sakai, the sensei's new pet. And you're a gift well, to you a chance at a better life and food away. Is that what he told you? Tomoy, why are we talking? So I can warn you to watch your back. What? My sensei tried to kill me. He'll try the same with you. Thanks for the warning, but I'm here to end this. It's already over. I have nothing. No one. Put the bow down, Tomoe. Has she lost her mind? No sign of her. I should tell Sensei Ishikawa. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> so she's saying that the Sensei is trying to kill me. Hmm. And he was trying to kill her. So he's gonna do the same to me. Okay, I have a feeling that's not even true. Sakai, what happened? Tomoe could have killed me, but she didn't. You let her get away. She jumped off a cliff. I saw her. You saw what she wanted you to. She sounded desperate. She is, because of us. Why does she think you'll turn on me? She doesn't. She's trying to drive a wedge between us, and it's working. No, it's not. Good. But the next time you wonder if I can do what's needed, ask yourself first. The way isn't finished yet. I guess they shall go north to curry favor with the Mongols. We'll find her. Maybe I'll act three.
Okay. So now we're probably gonna go to another sensei. What's her name again? Uh We're gonna go to Lady Mazuko. Anything, my lord. Uh, hold on one second. Let me check this out. Okay, guys. So <coughs> I actually want to like do this mission, the side mission, just Lord to get like. Sakai, please join me. Just so I can get this armor. Awaits you. I only want to do this just to get this armor. Yeah, the Gosoku armor. Badly, my lord. Two and a half centuries ago, Tsushima was terrorized by the Red Hand Bandits of Akashima. Around this time, a farmer named Gosaku heard the spirit of a dead samurai calling to him. He found the body, still clad in brilliant armor, overwhelmed by the armor's beauty. Gosaku stole it. Before long, the Red Hand reached Gosaku's home, knowing the farmers would lose everything if the bandits went unchallenged. Gosaku donned the samurai's armor. The bandits charged. Gosaku's sword arm trembled in fear. He resigned himself to death, but blow after blow glanced off the armor, and Gosaku did not falter. The bewildered bandits staggered back, tripping over their feet. A mysterious sense of calm suffused Gosaku's body and mind. Impressed by Gosaku's bravery, the dead samurai spirit guided his blade. Before long, Gosaku cut down the final bandit, and the Red Hand were never seen again. Years later, when Gosaku died, the farming families locked the armor away for safekeeping. Each family holds a single key to the lock. Now, Terra stalks our island again. The farmers of Tsushima claim to have seen Gosaku high on a hill, looking for a mighty warrior to protect our farms once more. The unbreakable Gosaku. <coughs> the armor is still locked away. And now the Mongols are hunting for it. Raiding farms across the island in search of the keys. Which farmsteads hold the keys? Hmm. Aoi, Ijima, Kuta, Koshimizu, Ohama, and Yagata. If you find the keys, they say the armor is hidden on a hilltop in Akashima. The Mongols will never lay hands on it. Of that, I am certain, my lord. Let's get the armor. Oh, it's two kilometers away. Now it's only 500 meters away.
A Mongol territory. Got a hostage there. Yeah, I only came here for the armor. Able to heal those old wounds. I'm saved. Go. And stay safe. It feels so worthless lately. Hold on one second, guys. Okay, there's no one at the door. Get out of my I know this is not what uncle wants, but still Whatever to have to do to get the armor, it's worth it
Bravo! Marcella! We have two beds! ten Still. We thought our farm was lost, Lord Sakai. Did the Mongols take your key to Kosaka's armor? No. You may have it. If more Mongols come, they'll get nothing from us. The key. Let's try. Let's get this armor. Hold on one second. Look, so apparently the armor is here, so now. We're gonna go get it.
that I need some steak there's it says here there's enemy oh Safe now. Maybe I'll <sighs> What's next? Ah, I see.
There. You're going to be all right. <coughs> For a moment, I thought you were Gosaku himself. Please, take this key. He'd be grateful if you donned his armor. Okay. I got another key for the armor. Now what? Hold on one second, guys. Okay. I think it's here. Yeah, this is the place. Maybe this is where I'll get the chest armor. So basically what I think they're trying to do is try to like give us keys so you could use that to like find an armor. Actually, the keys, they're probably used to like unlock the armor. So I think somewhere here in this area. Oh yeah, I'm here, I'm here. Correct directions. Now we're gonna go to the other side. Alright, you know what, forget it. We're just gonna climb here. So this is a way I can get new swords without buying any. I don't think that's gonna work yet unless I like you know So it looks like I already done it here. No, let's just go. Yeah, that was the part where Jen, where Jen shows his butt. I don't allow nude on my channel. This is a 15 plus. This is a PG 15 
This channel is the age rated for 15. <coughs> and I might do my GTA 6. And I might play GTA 5 on on YouTube. Like it's gonna be a live stream. I'm gonna call it playing GTA 5 for GTA 6. And basically, and basically I'm gonna make it like you know. Wait, hold on a second, guys. All right, let's continue this. Honestly, I like Stranger Things. Like, now that I'm thinking about Drake talking to Millie, it honestly made, has me thinking about Stranger Things and on how good the show is. Kill enemies without healing. Okay, don't heal. No! <sighs> Stupid mutt. I mean, I like dogs, but these dogs in the game are not as the one are not the ones that I like. Like, there is a dog back in my cousin's house, and. It's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Are there any other enemies?
Lord Sakai, you have my thanks. Go, and stay safe. This guy's good. I like this. Anyway, it's about Stranger Things. Season 4 is probably my most favorite. Like, that's what I watched mostly. And it's honestly really funny on how, like, you know... The other guy did not believe Lucas on when he was trying to say that, you know, Max was in the... When Max was getting, like, you know, summit. When Max was getting killed by Vecna. And he tried to explain, explain about why... Why Chrissy was hanging out was in Eddie's house, and he told him on how he tried like on how Chrissy was seeing stuff that Vecna forced her to see, and he said that's how I know you're lying because she would have seen stuff she would have come to me. Take this key to Gosaku's armor, put it to good use. Have you ever seen the armor yourself? We'd never dare look, my lord. If we were to keep it safe for someone like you. Okay, another key. So that's three. So now we only got a few more until we only got three more and then we can get the armor. This should be easy. This is like a walk in the park. Here, this is my thumbnail.
Am I supposed to like follow the fox or something? There we guess so. Damn it, deer hunt is over. Atreus would be mad. Ah, we're Muslims. We don't eat pork. Tadam, because we're eating, because pigs eat their own poop. So we don't eat pork because pigs eat their own poop. So to the Americans that are watching, pigs eat their own poop. that you're eating is pig pigs eat their own poop so since you're eating pork you're eating you're eating what pigs eat their own poop I also think I'll do a gameplay series when Metal Gear 3 comes out. Like, you know the game Metal Gear Solid? Well, there's gonna be a new game called Metal Gear Solid Snake Eater. It's honestly a remake. It's a remake from, like, you know, the old Metal Gear Snake Eater. And... <clears throat> Assassinate from above. There's no other way. Remember you go be well. I mean, they did remastered Snake Eater, but see, there's a difference between 
there's a difference between remake and remastered <clears throat> see remastered is when you like take a game from the old times and then bring it to the new console remake is basically when you take an old game and add like better graphics to make it look cooler and and different lines but the same story but different lines like for example when resident evil 2 got a remake it became a hit and honestly resident evil 3 is my favorite out of the resident evil series and i will do a gameplay series of resident evil's I will do a gameplay series of Resident Evil 3 Remake soon. Like, I already have a list of new games, but I'm gonna tell them... I'm gonna tell them at the end of the... At the end of Ghost of Tsushima. Like, part... Like, the final part of Ghost of Tsushima. Like, I'm gonna tell them the. F I'll tell you guys at the final part of Ghost of Tsushima what's gonna be the next games I'll play. Because honestly, there are two game. There are actually two games that I wanna play on the game. On YouTube that I didn't finish yet. And some of them are from my favorite. And all of them are actually on my favorite. From my favorite video game company Naughty Dog. Square Enix, Capcom, and Rockstar Games. Take a hint. Take a hint on uh, what games I'll play next. I already, I already give you. So think about which game I'll play. Alright, let's continue this. All right, let's save the hostage. So here's the hint. You'll be free soon. I'll tell you later. I thought the Mongols would take our heads, my lord. The Mongols seek the armor of a hero named Gosaku. Please take this key to it. You deserve to wear it. I won't let the Mongols come near Gosaku's legacy. Okay, so. So we only got probably a few more keys until we get like the armor and then we'll probably like you know continue the story and maybe do lady mazuko like i am concerned on who's her family killer It's just nearby. Seven, seven hundred and ten meters. Also, my favorite thing from Stranger Things season three, season three final episode, is when Dusty Bun and Susie Pooh sang the song "Never Ending Story." It basically goes like this: Turn around. Look at what you see in her face. The mirror of her dream. I don't know the rest of the lyrics. I probably have to watch the show to remember. But I think I might I add that on like the 10 year anniversary, but not the Stranger Things version. I'll add like the original version. You do know Never Ending Story is an actual song. They didn't make it up. It's an actual song that you can listen to. And I think when I'm when I'm doing the 10 year anniversary and when me, frontman and you new characters get ready for a battle, I'll add that song as like the get get ready for a battle. I think. 
I don't know. I don't want to get copyright from Netflix because I love that company. And if I get sued by Netflix, that means I'll hate Netflix and I'll never watch Netflix again. But still, I love Netflix and there are shows in there that I really, 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 really want to watch. Like seriously, Cobra Kai is going to have an is going to have a season finale in three parts per ep and there's going to be 15 episodes per part. There's going to be 15 episodes per part. All right. Sla slaughter and other and enemies of leather. So there's gonna be three. Here you. I really love this. And I'm soon going to be graduating and I'm actually gonna be fair with you. I am really gonna miss some of the friends I call fake. But I'm not talking about the guy that I came in the Fortnite live stream. I'm talking about the other ones that I usually hang out with during lunch. Hold still. Like there are some people that I like in the school. Like, see, okay. So in the last video, I said a lot of mean stuff about them, and I thought they deserve it. But to be fair. They don't. They're actually really nice. And even though they're never gonna call me and never gonna ask to hang out with me, still, I will miss them. Like, see, let's say, let's say for example, there's this one girl, there's this one girl that I've known since fifth grade, and she's honestly very nice. Yeah, and I actually, I actually like her. I actually like her. And there's another girl who is also vice president of the school, of the school something, I think. And even though she broke my heart because I wanted to ask her to prom and she said it was a joke at the end. Because see, basically this is what happened. We were talking about prom and I said I wanted to ask out someone to prom. And then she said, why don't you ask me to prom? And get this, I actually wanted to take her to prom. I actually did want to take her to prom. And she said that she wanted to buy me a lot of stuff to prom pros. And I was like, don't you think that's a bit too much? Because honestly, that is uh, what I'm saying is fair. Like, seriously, you know who to ask for these kind of stuff? Gold diggers. And it's like Kanye West said. Now, I ain't saying she a gold digger, but she ain't messing with no broke N-word. Yeah, I'm not going to say the actual N-word on camera. Because I'm not racist. Where... Oh, I think it's yeah, it's here. Okay, anyways, about the girl that broke my heart. She's honestly nice. Like, see, I like, see, this is what happened. I didn't show up to school for like a week, and she gave me a hug, acting like I haven't showed up in like years. Which I honestly don't get, but honestly, thank you. And there's another girl that calls me buddy, and to be fair, I don't really care about her. But she is, uh, but honestly, I will miss the way she always calls me buddy. 
I will miss her how, the way she calls me buddy. She was like, I'm she's still. always going like this. I'm buddy. I'm buddy. I'm buddy. And honestly, I'm gonna miss the way she said that because it's honestly, because to be fair, it's honestly funny. And there's another girl who made me like some bracelets, and she's nice. She's nice. I have no, I have nothing to say bad about her. And there's another guy that hangs out with the girls. And I said he was gay, but and I said I think he's gay, but I said I think he's gay, but he's actually not gay. He's actually not gay. Like I had some plenty of reasons why I think he was gay. Like number one, I didn't see, I never see him hang out with a dude before, so that makes sense why I think he's gay. And number two, all he does is hang out with girls and. That honestly is a sign saying saying why I think he's gay because see I was watching this movie called Mean Girls and this guy named Ga Damien he you know the guy that's almost too gay to function I think you know who Damien is you know the guy that's too gay to function okay I think we already completed everything so now we can get the armor so anyways, Damien, the guy, the guy that's, you know, too gay to function. <sighs> so anyways, I thought he was like him, but no, it turns out he was not gay all along. He's actually straight. I mean, to be fair, he did ask out one of my friends to prom, and that's honestly a, what a straight man would do, asking a girl out to prom. To be fair, I actually thought he was going to ask a dude out to prom. Because if he asked to, because if he was gay, then he's no longer going to be my friend, because you know how people say, you know how people say, whoa, are you a homophobe? Are you homophobic? Well, guess what? I am homophobic. All right. I refuse to be around gay people. I refuse to be around lesbians. I refuse to be around transgender. I refuse any of that, okay? No gays, no lesbians, no transgender, okay? Only straight people, all right? If I see a, if I see a man saying he likes penis, then no. If I see a woman saying he li she likes vagina, then no but if i see a man saying he likes he likes vagina then yeah and if i see a girl saying she likes penis then that's just weird because that'll make me feel insecure about my penis Actually kill the Mongol leader even though I gathered all of every skill I need. Nothing? <coughs> Mongols got here first. Locked. I should try one of the keys. Alright. Time to get the armor that I've always wanted. But to be fair, I think my father armor would be amazing. Actually, I was lying. This is not the armor I always wanted. I just wanted to make a joke like Laser Beam. Because he's basically like, you know, probably like another Mr. Beast clone. And you know how like Mr. Beast always says like joke like he says, are we really going to blow it up? And he's like, yeah. And he's like, okay. So that's what I want to do. I want to be like a Mr. Beast clone. And, my, and I really don't uh, and I really don't care if I hit either hit 100 million subscribers 
or 200 million like now mr beast is in a subscriber race with t-series and my vote i'm going for mr beast side because honestly i don't like t-series and i honestly like the diss track that pewdiepie did to t-series you know the b lasagna b lasagna b lasagna t-series you ain't t-series you're nothing but a b lasagna sturdy surprisingly light that is the most beautiful thing i've ever seen in my entire life of playing ghost of tsushima i just want to scream right now but i can't so i'm just gonna go like this I don't know if I swear it, but even though if I did, I'm sorry. Now, now let's see what we can get. Oh, I have enough supplies to upgrade it. And enough supplies to upgrade that also. You know what? We're gonna go to we're gonna go to a village and upgrade this. I'm sorry I'm laughing. It's just that I was watching a movie and it was basically an Adam Sandler movie where he basically was playing as a drunk man named Donnie Berger. It was like, What's that? I can help you improve your blades, my lord. <laughs> Goodbye. I'll get more. Don't worry. All my goods are useful. You can bring more, it's yours. Where can I go to upgrade my armor? No, oh, no, no, yeah. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I know the place. I know the place. I know the perfect place. The Golden Temple. Let's go. Alright, anyways, about my friends, okay? So, there's another one with glasses, and I don't know how I, how long I, oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! That's also really cool! That's also really cool! Oh, we're gonna purchase this. Certain to frustrate your enemies. I don't have enough to purchase this. Oh, just get this goofy hat! Alright, so we're gonna like. Visit Omni Village. Home. Return home to Omni Village. Hmm. Alright, so... Um, okay, I'm gonna be fair with you. I do not like that hat, so I'm gonna change. Huh. This is honestly a good match. I like this one. Uh, <laughs> 
There you go. That honestly looks better. I want to scream again, but I think I already pissed off my brothers enough, so... Yeah. But I mean, I could scream if I want to. Like, my family, the, my mom, dad, uncle, and grandma, they're in travel. So, it's just me and my brothers. Oh. Looks like today is a good day. I'm playing Ghost of Tsushima. I'm back on YouTube. I'm almost getting better for my sickness. I think tomorrow I'll hit the gym. Show me your skill. I, th I will go. I think I'll go back to the gym tomorrow. I'll text my trainer to see. I'll text my trainer to see. Okay. Another Mongol leader killed, and I get nothing. Ah, 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 stupid mutt. Hey, I didn't see you. It's almost like you never existed in the first place. Actually, you sh Never mind, I'm not gonna say it. Anyways, about the hint for the games, I'll give you a little. Oh, hmm. A samurai could rest for a bit, maybe get some motivations. You know what? Screw it. I'm just only here for the extra health. I'll be right back. All right. Now my reflection is on. I'm gonna sense Ryozu's betrayal. We grew up together, but you threw it all away. How long will it last, Rizzo? How long until the Mongols get tired of your excuses? Yay, health. Alright, let's continue. Alright, so now... No. The shrine has been desecrated. Who would do this? Don't know. Don't care. If it was a Muslim shrine, then I would 100% care. But I don't think we do the shrines. I'll ask my dad. Another girl in my class who also was also like was tall, wear glasses, and she's honestly nice. And wait, is there any is there anyone else I forgot to mention about? Hmm. Oh yeah, there are more. There are other there. I hang out with different people other than them. Like there was this one girl. There's this one girl who's Iraqi, who's Iraqi, and she's honestly my neighbor, and she is very nice. Like, every every time when she walks in the hallway, she always gives me high fives. <laughs> and, yeah, she's nice. And there's another girl who hangs out with her, and she is Lebanon, and she's also nice. And sometimes I like to joke around with her because it's honestly funny seeing her mad. And also, there's another girl, she's a redhead, and I don't know which uh, region she's in, maybe uh, Iraqi, I think? I mean, I mean, pa- No, 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 no,
Change she's Lebanese. And she, she's actually, she's actually like very, very nice. And there was another girl that came, that used to go to my school, but now she doesn't. And she was the third nicest person i would known. Like every time when I walk in the hallway and she sees me, she always calls me Habibi. And, and, and if you don't know Arabic, Habibi and Habibi means my love. So basically, she loves me. And I don't know why she loves me. I did ask her why. And she said that I was always nice to her. And, the village. Home. and it does make sense since my, since my mom and my dad are the nicest people I know. Anyways, we're back in Omi village. No sign of Mongols. Nope. Oh, the armor. Where is it? Where is it? How dare you! Oh. You're cool. You must. I feared you were dead. <laughs> I came as soon as I could. It's good to see you, Yuriko. Yuriko. You look tired. <clears throat> Are you hungry? Not now. Thank you. The Khan's army must have marched past here. Have you had any trouble? A few bandits. Nothing I can't take care of. I've come from my father's. My armor. You refused to wear it at Komoda Beach. A lot has changed since then. I hid it somewhere safe. Ah, good call. Thank you. Ghost from the past. Hmm. I also like that. I wonder what Ghost of Tsushima 2 will look be like. And if it did release, I will 100% do a series on that. And it's going to be one hell of a game. And, my, and I take it, it will be nominated Game of the Year. I take it. I'll get Taichi to help me fetch it. He's at the cemetery. What's he doing there? Tending the grounds. Gathering plants for my poisons. Keeps vermin out of our food stores. Huh. I'm glad you're not alone. What about Lord Shimura? Alive. The Mongols captured him at Komoda, but we freed him. Oh, others survived. And they're helping you? A few. Lady Musical. Good. She's been fighting alongside the boys since she was knee-high. <laughs> You'll have to tell me more about that someday. But it's just the two of you? A few others. Sensei Ishikawa. I haven't seen him in years. Does he still act like he's the only one who knows how to do things? Half the time he's right, but his aim is unmatched. He would certainly agree. Lord Sakai, you're back! I wish I could stay, but I hear you're taking good care of Yuriko. You've got that backwards, my lord. Daichi, help me get the Sakai armor. Go. I should pay my respects. Oh my, I'm gonna go to my the father's. Haven't been pulled. I'm sorry, Yuriko. Our Lord finally returns and his home is on the I'm going to my father's grave. <sighs> time to speak with my father after all these times. Oh, oh, it's here. All right. Reflect on legacy.
I've never gotten this close to the game. I've actually never gotten this close to the game. I mourn my father. We used to meditate here. Now I am alone. Put on your father's armor. So when we get my father's armor, I'll end the video. <laughs> Turn around. Look at what you see in her face. The armor's inside, my lord. The mirror of her dream. The armor. Jen, it's yours now. That's how it's put on. There's like a strap on it. Jin. I understand what you did was I understand that you were a coward but listen to me your name is Jin Sakai you are the ghost of Tsushima and that armor that you see right there that's yours now <laughs> It looks good on you. Are you alright? Yes, just lightheaded. For a moment I thought you looked. Face us, coward! Get inside. Time to Sakai mask. I'm never taking that off. Come here and fight! Was cool. Lord Sakai. But I got blood all on the armor. Are you all right? You butchered them. Is Yarikawa giving us trouble again? The Yarikawa rebellion was twenty years ago. Those men were with the Mongols. Of course. Seeing you like that, I'm still shaken up. I need to catch my breath. By the lake. Your favorite tree. Yes. Come. You said earlier you've been making poisons. Keeps the vermin out of our rice. Can you make it stronger? Enough to kill a man? No one deserves that. Can you do it? The effects in larger doses are ugly. Good. Oh, my lord. Sit with me a moment. Who 
poison has never been the Sakai way. No Sakai had to fight the Mongol Empire. I need every weapon we have. Tsushima can't afford anything less. The Mongols have changed you, young master. The world has changed. That's true. My mother taught me about plants that heal, others that harm, even kill. But they must be consumed. How will you poison the invaders? A blowgun and darts. I've read of their use by a Genji warrior who studied with monks from the West. Will you help me? Promise me you'll remain the good man I know. I promise. I've looked after your every need since your mother carried you. I won't stop now. All I need is something to make a blowgun. Used to be plenty of reeds downriver, near the old crossing. Remember? You and your little friend gathered them to make little boats. Yuzo and I. Sorry about that, guys. Spent all day reenacting the Battle of Dunnora. Be careful, Jin. The invaders have an outpost there now. Don't worry. I'll be back soon with reeds. Go on. I'll be fine. Okay. Let's just do this quickly. Oh. Hold on a second. Huh? That's honestly really cool. I think I'm gonna do it in the next video. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.